Good afternoon and welcome to Windy Hill Kennel. This is the 17th of December and this is Maggie's kids. So eyes are finally open. They are two weeks old and um, two days. So we're 16 days old today. Um, they're doing really good. They're getting nice and fat. I know you're just not happy campers. This is the first time they've been away from mom. So I have a screamer down here. So we're gonna hope that we get through it without blood curdling screams, which are normal, uh, especially for this one says, I am not looking that direction. <laughs> okay, I'll leave you right there, I promised. So I'm gonna weigh them for you this morning uh, or this afternoon. We're gonna get them back down to mom. But I wanted to let you know the eyes were open. Probably tomorrow uh, or, no, it won't be tomorrow. Um, I will try t today or tomorrow, but if not, it will be Sunday. I have 11 puppies going home tomorrow and Saturday, so it's going to be a full day. But we wanted to get you a video with their eyes open and let you see how they're doing. So I'm going to start with this one. I'm going to chip it before I pick it up because he is not a happy camper. 5598 is the microchip. This is the Phantom. I know, I'm gonna be really easy. I'm gonna be really easy. Is this a boy or a girl? This is a boy. Thought it might be. Oh, that's good, you didn't scream. Um, he's doing really good. His coloring is starting to come out on his legs and his feet. He's got great coloring on his face already. And I'm hoping that Vanessa can zoom in really close and get your eye pictures. They're gonna look blue to you, or they should look blue to you, but they're not blue. Um, all puppies' eyes look blue when you shoot pictures with my flash or probably with the uh, cell phone um, because the light reflects off the pupil and it looks blue. Are you seeping again? Is you seeping again? Wake up. Yeah, I know. Can you wake up for everybody? Everybody wants to see your peepers. I may wait till Monday. Their eyes will be a lot more uh, vibrant and open by then because I know this eye on this side of the puppy is still not quite 100% open. So it's still got a little ways to go and the lights are bright so they're going to keep their eyes shut a little bit more. Um, he's got really nice coat. I'm going to be really easy. I won't move you fast. He's got lots of waves and curls coming. Hi bud. He says, what are you? And she's doing a great job with him. She really is. She's, they're just nursing really good. They're nice and fat. They're just super nice babies. Yeah, he says, I don't know if I like this or not. All right, now that I've talked so much, I have to turn the scale back on. Um, so I hope, not sure what your weather is, but our area, we got about three inches of snow last night. I don't think we had this much snow last year. Okay, let's put you down really easy. It's cold, I'm warning you. One pound, 8.4. Okay, I'm gonna get you picked up. I'm gonna get you picked up. So that's the male. It's all right. I know. He says, I don't want to lay like this. You're back asleep again. I know. They're all going to turn around here. Come up here, pumpkin. I was sure somebody was going to potty when I picked him up because, whoo, it did smell down here. $55.99. Oops, she says, I'm backing up. Beep, beep, beep. You forgot to turn your beeper on. This is the female. She is the Phantom Merle. I love the phantom markings. They're starting to show up on her feet also and up her legs. She's going to be a beautiful blue merle, with, which will be this lighter silver, all of her gray, and you can see under here, see how light it's getting already? So her black is gonna stay black and her silver is gonna turn a beautiful color of silver, just like her dad. Yep, you're gonna be a pretty baby but she's doing really good. Um, I'm not gonna turn her over. We did that when they were babies and I don't wanna freak her out this time. Um, they're really not doing anything at this point but nursing. Nursing is sleeping and going to the bathroom. I know, turn you around that way they can see your eyes up close and I won't make you lay funny. She's got her eyes open really good. Now she does have the option, she doesn't have the option, Mother Nature gave her that option. Um, her eyes have the option of being blue or black. And since she is a, a blue Merle, they're, if they're not blue when she's older, they will be black. So at this point, if you are seeing blue in her eyes when I shoot it with a camera, 
or the video, that does not mean they're going to be blue eyes. So we won't really know that till between five and six weeks old for sure. But the odds are they're probably going to be black. All right, so let's see what you weigh before. Oh, geez, I did it again. I should weigh them before I jabber. Okay, let's see what you weigh. I feel a cold nose down there. You're back asleep again. All right, let's see what she weighs. She's the littlest one in the litter. One pound, 2.6. You're nice and chunky. Yeah, you're nice and chunky. All right, let me turn her around. I'm gonna turn you both around. There you go. I know. Just lay still. Just lay there for a minute and you'll go back to sleep. Nope, I'm not gonna let go of you yet until you lay down. Once they feel like I feel them relax, I can usually move my hands and they shush up. I'll get you in a minute. Nope. Oh, just as I felt you move your fingers. He's not as easy to do. All right, this is the black and white. You're like a rag doll. <laughs> says, I'm seeping. I'm seeping. Yeah, I'm says I'm seeping. This is the female. She's got She's like, I'm gonna lick your fingers if you hold still. She's the biggest, I think, in the litter. She's got her eyes open, but I don't think they're 100%. She says, oh, I'm just so tired. Eat, sleep, and poop at this point is basically all you do, huh, punk? You can see those little eyes if I hold her this way, maybe before she shuts them again. Can you wake up? She says, no, can I just go back to sleep? <laughs> so I just go back, there we go. Eyes are closing. She's. <laughs> So I just want to go back to sleep, okay? Aww. I know. Oh, she says I'm so tired. Is that better? There you go. Now you can go to sleep. Uh, I know you're going to hate me. I'm going to roll you. Coats are doing really good. I'm not going to make her wake up. She's got lots of, uh, lots of thick coat coming. She's got really pretty coat. Are you awake again? No. She won't. <laughs> I'm going to lay her down and weigh her. She says, oh, do I have to wake up? Let's see if we can get you to sleep on this cold pan. She goes, whoa, that's cold. One pound, 7.8. Okay, I'm getting you. I'm getting you. So since she's awake, she's got really pretty color. You got a little bit of poop on your butt, sis. Mom must have cleaned you up before you come up here and she didn't get you off. She says, just let me go back to sleep. At this age, that's just it. It's eat, sleep, and forget it. But she's doing really good. She's got nice coat, nice fat body. There, right, lay back down. Oh, she says, there we go. So there's not a whole lot at this age. Um, they are going to, they were wormed on, yes, on yesterday. They were wormed, shush up. Oh, microchip, sorry. Uh, 55.97, okay. So they were wormed yesterday. Uh, so that's done. Two more weeks, they're going to get their first four-way, um, not a four-way, I'm sorry. They get their four-week Parvo booster, and that'll be at four weeks old. And um, so they're on their way. At three weeks old, they're going to get dumped out of the welt box on the floor. So believe it or not, in three weeks, these little guys will be walking all over the place. Not coordinatedly, but they will be walking. Um, but usually by three weeks, they want out of that welt box. They're standing up, looking over the edge of it. And uh, so at that point, we'll turn them loose and put them on the floor in their cubicle. Uh, right now, we've got mom in the building in a four-foot cubicle. So it keeps it quiet for her. She's under a heater, keeps the puppies warm. And she can go out her door. She's got a spring-loaded door that lets her go outside to go potty. And then she can come back into her babies and they stay warm while she's outside. So um, they're all doing great, no issues at all. So we're on the way to becoming real puppies. Right now they're just look alike puppies because they don't do anything. See, we just sleep. But if you have questions about them, please feel free to give me a call. I will shoot you some new pictures, but I might wait another day or two uh, until their eyes get completely open. I think he's still the one that's dragging his feet. Oh, is that tickle? He says, oh, there's something on my neck. So call me if you have questions. I hope you've enjoyed their pictures or their videos. And I'll get you pictures before Christmas, I promise. And have a good one. Call me with questions. And have a happy holiday. Talk to you later.